Meet the newly minted 2017 Bronx Council on the Arts Brio Award winners. The group took their bows at a special ceremony at the Longwood Art Gallery at Hostos Community College. The idea is to uh, bring, them in, bring them and connect them with art, pretty much, and sort of uh, also bring some awareness to some of the uh, social political things that we're facing as a community with some development, some gentrification. Um, so, you know, the idea is to use my art as a way or as a tool of um, enriching the, or, or bringing, bringing more uh, light to the uh, community and, and sort of celebrating also our own culture. I showed work that I did at BAD um, last year. Um, I did my artist in residence there and uh, I had a full evening of work. So I showed material, um, I think it was up to 10 minutes of video from my performance, uh, the choreography I did um, in that night. And uh, I guess they liked it. Give me just one more chance. Save me this one last dance. I know it's getting high. Since 1989, the Bronx recognizes its own Orbrio has awarded more than 1.1 million in funds to 399 artists from the Bronx. I've been singing since I was a kid, uh, raised in the Bronx, so to win an award like this is, uh, is an honor. The group was selected based on the quality of their submissions, each judged by a panel of professionals representing the categories of performing, media, literary, and visual arts. Ruth Marshall, originally from Australia, won in that category. It's just really important to have this celebratory moment. Uh, this is my fourth Brio Award. It was amazing. I mean, that's, it's a very competitive uh, award. It's, uh, the rec it's a recognition. Charlie Vasquez with the Bronx Council on the Arts invites all Bronx artists to participate. It's all done online through the submittable platform, so you can go to bronxarts.org or, or search us, Bronx Council on the Arts, and it's listed under grants uh, on the website. And Lydia Clark, a manager with the Brio Awards, had the tough job of calling all the winners. To be able to give money to help support artists, it's like Christmas to me. So from 150 to 200 entries, somehow they're able to whittle that number down to 39. Very pleased artist here tonight. For BronxNet, this is Arlene Makoko.